The Israeli fans of the Argentine soccer club San Lorenzo have invaded the holy city. The goal, taking over the Wailing Wall and convincing God to help their team, which is not doing so well in the league back in Argentina. San Lorenzo's last season was catastrophic. The veteran and well-respected club suffered a number of humiliating defeats. The local branch of the team knows that without faith, San Lorenzo will continue to be beaten. And when the big moment arrives, the Wailing Wall looks more like the eastern bleachers. San Lorenzo was founded in 1908 by a Catholic priest in Buenos Aires. Now the Jewish fans from Israel are asking for heaven's mercy. Shortly before sending their prayers up to the Lord, the Argentine fans shore up their defenses. But the Israeli media hasn't given up and takes the offensive. When the wall is but an arm's length away, the sanctity can be felt in the air. They have a good, I mean, a better chance now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, with, with Simcha, with Simcha, yeah. that's the best chance. That's the only chance. At the end of their visit to the Wailing Wall, San Lorenzo's Israeli fans can claim an achievement unprecedented since the visit of Maradona to the Holy Land and the help from heaven that soon followed. <laughs> On Shabbat evening, without paying attention, the soccer-crazy Argentines <laughs> prove that coexistence between the religions is possible in the Holy City. Of course, we're referring to Judaism and soccer.